the road. In the road. <laughs> Yo, we almost at church. We're looking to have a high time. This is an exciting day for us. Our son, our baby boy, TK, is preaching his first message as a minister of the gospel. And we're praying for him, but that God touch him and use him on today. Son, I know God is ready to work with you, man. Oh, man. What's my step for brother? What giant step for? For the spirit. <laughs> That's what's up. And yeah, that's what's up. And Gotti, wherever you are, I think wherever you are, Gotti, we wish you were here. You should be here. As y'all know, Gotti is our oldest son, Torn. Yeah, he should be here. It's all good, dude. We're praying and believing God. We're about to pull up to the church. Wish y'all could be here with us, but stay with us on our journey. Y'all can see some stuff a little bit later. And when I get to the ministry, I got to encounter hypocritical hooks. And I got to encounter hypocritical handshakes. And I got to encounter hypocritical I love you's. And I'm thinking to myself, how do I find more joy on the outside of the walls of the ministry from a stranger than I do on the inside of the church? I thought I had somebody up in here that was going to feel me. If, you, if you're feeling me, look at somebody that's closest to you and say, in the morning. In the morning. So here it is. God got these people in a situation for a reason. He needs these people to be fully developed while they're going through that situation. But God did not tell you to move, so you're moving anyway. So now you have caused them, you have caused yourself to become a crush. Now you have crushed this individual, so now whenever they feel that they are going through something that they cannot overcome, and now they feel it in their mind that they can rely on you to pull them out of whatever it is they need instead of relying. Somebody and say, Come on. Come on. Come on. Well, here it is right here. If I had about three blessed believers that can feel me, I need you to lean on somebody and say, Weeping may endure for a night. But in the morning, how the Lord joy. We see ourselves when we're looking at the internet and we're causing ourselves to be mad and we're causing ourselves to get down. Now the Bible told us to encourage ourselves. We're seeing the things that people got and we're so worried about why do I not have it yet? And we're looking at it. I may not have a mansion on the heat, but the house that I got is mine. So that friends that walked away from me said you should curse God and die. Joe also had a spouse that walked away from him. Even had children that turned their backs on him. Now, I may not have a field full of acres, but the field that I've got is mine. I may not be driving what I want to drive, but the car that I'm driving is mine. I may not be wearing what I want to wear, but what I got on is mine. I may not be eating what I want to eat, but what my palate is consuming is mine. We just got our, our service. TK did his first message. I got my niece Karen here. Karen, the morning. Yes. In the morning, it was awesome. I'm happy for him, ain't you? Yes. God is good. I'll put this on the page. I'm in here with my deacons, deacons. We had a best time in the service, then we got Amen. TK did that awesome. thing. Awesome. God awesome. bless them, awesome. man. Awesome. <laughs> gotta get in this. This is Sister Carter. We had a good time at TK's first message in the Amen. morning. He blessed us, didn't he? You missed it. Ah, you missed it. We're gonna put our pain. What's up, baby? I wanna see the cassette. <laughs> you did you record everything? Hey, what's up, what's up, what's up? What's up? Know, hey, did we have a good time? Yeah, it's a great time. TK did a crazy job yes, in this thing. Did. God bless them. Hallelujah. Cheryl. Sure. Okay. Oh, no. We just got yeah. out of the service. There's a video oh, here. Let me get it together. <laughs> we just got out of our service with TK preaching his first yeah. message here at Tower of Power. We got our artist right, Shirley here. Shirley, right, he did a good right, job. Right. He did a few wonderful jobs. Awesome. Here in the morning. Y'all be blessed. All right, all right. What a uh -oh. awesome world. Then we in have a great morning. time. In the morning. TK blew it up. <laughs> That's my sister-in-law, y'all. Right. <laughs> we got Nikki here, too. Nikki, did we have a good time? Yes, I did. 
Garfield. Yeah, Garfield. This is did an awesome job. Hey, act like he was doing it for years, right? The anointing. Yes, he is. Yes, he does. Thank you, Nick. <laughs> Thank you for following us on our journey, for we are the Gatlins. Man, keep following us. We got more stuff that's coming. You just witnessed in this part of our journey, TK, my baby boy, receiving the calling into the ministry. He did a blessed job. God used him greatly. And all those that were there with us to celebrate with us. I'm still on the go. I'm still jumping. Man, I ain't got no voice. But I want y'all to keep up with us. Go to our page on YouTube. We are the Gatlins, our journey. And if you're on the channel, there's a button that sits there for subscribe. We want you to subscribe. We want you to like and share with all your others about us and our journey. We having fun doing it and we want to take you along with us. So until next time, I'm A.G. Gatlin from We Are the Gatlins, our journey. Keep following us. It's going to be a great ride.